Hi, my name is Matt. Welcome to Kibbutz Lotan. Uh, I'm about to show you around our eco campus neighbourhood. Our filmer here is, is Ben from America. Yes, this is Ben. <laughs> so studying sustainability, very exciting. Hello. Here we have um, a dome, and this is what all our houses are made out of. This steel is kind of the bare, the bare. Um, what would you say, Ben, about this? The backbone. <laughs> the backbone. Of the, the domes that you see, that you'll see surrounding the area where we live, and as you can see, these are the domes. Finished product. The finished product, and um, which are made out of. <laughs> so now I'm going to take you. So what you want to see and what you want to know, want to know about is the, is the toilet. So this is the toilet. This is a composting toilet. So you have to knock just in case. In case. Hello? There's no one in it. So <laughs> no. This is the toilet. This is the least interesting one. Let's go on the other one. Okay. This is, <laughs> okay. This is more interesting. Sorry. Oh yeah, much better. Okay, so this is the toilet. Um, now... Usually, you go to the toilet, you flush the chain, there's no chain here. No. Nope. And what happens is, you go to the toilet, and, uh, yep, that's lovely. There's a net there to catch the wee, and that's where the poo goes. And it goes down, and once you've finished, you put a straw on it. And there's no straw left, so no. I'm just going to have to fill that. Oh, there's the straw. There's the there's straw. The you straw. get a cup of straw. Um, you fill the cup, and you put it down here. And then you put it down, and, and that's, that's how you do your business <laughs> here. And uh, that's a compost toilet. And I'll tell you why that's special. So what happens with our, our human excrement waste that goes into the toilets there is it turns into compost and this takes about a year. And you could, with this compost, um, take it to a vegetable garden and use the compost as soil and grow your vegetable seed, well put your vegetable seeds in there and grow vegetables. So it's one big cycle, nothing gets wasted, even our waste doesn't get wasted. So there's the cycle, excellent. So, these are the solar panels, and as you can see, the sun is now directly beaming down onto these solar panels, and what happens here is the sun beams down on the solar panels and provides electricity throughout the, most of the camp. Well, look over here, look over here. Right here, you can see we've got another solar panel. Is this a solar panel? It's a solar hot water solar heater. Solar hot water. So what happens is the sun beams down from over there, the sun's beaming down, it beams down onto that, it heats up that, which makes hot water. Go into that. Go into, Don't forget into these. the shower. This is Avi. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hello. What happens to that water after you shower yourself? Um, does it go back to the plant? Follow the pipe. Follow the pipe. Where, where is it going? See that palm tree? This one. That will be a big, big palm tree. Another Bam. palm tree. Another palm tree. And, and again, so we're not wasting any water. We're giving it to trees and helping them grow. Thank you. Thank you, Avi. So. How do we eat here, I hear you say? What do we cook with? Well, I'll show you what we cook with. We cook with this thing here. It's called a solar oven. And how does the solar oven work? Well, what happens is the sun comes from the sky, beams down onto the mirror. The mirror hits the solar oven base. And in the base here is where we cook our stuff. We put the stuff in here. And as you can see, we've got some cakes baking. I'm very, very excited to eat these cakes. They look lovely. And um, also we have some water boiling, which I put in earlier. Um, and I'm now going to take it out, I'm going to, hopefully it will be nice with some tea, so here we go. Doesn't that look nice? And there you have one lovely cup of British made tea. Cheers. Lovely. This is Ben's house, as you can see it's very My pretty. dome, container garden, veggies growing out of there. Yeah, that's really cool. And this is my dome, here we go. As you can see, there's my dome. This is dome one. This is the first dome they ever built, actually, incidentally. And um, as you can see, we'll go into it now. As you can see, and it, there's my bed. <laughs> Bit of a mess. Um, we've got windows, and it's kind of a circular, it's like a dome. It's a bit like an igloo, but a neat mm -hmm. igloo. Um, I haven't got much in here, just a bed. Um, and what can I tell you about this? We keep the windows open during the day to catch the sunlight. Um, so the sunlight comes in and as soon as the sun goes down, which is very soon, I'm going to close all the windows and the heat will be contained in the dome and it will make it very warm for me tonight to sleep in. And the, that's the end of our tour. Um, I, hope you, I hope you like our eco neighbourhood. And um, 
if you want to get involved, you should visit our website. We've got lots of different programs that go on here. You could be an eco-volunteer like me for a short period, or you could come for a bit longer like I'm planning to do maybe next year and get on one of our educational programs, the Living Roots program, um, which is what Ben's on. Uh, or you could do the Green Apprenticeship, which is um, a few months program and very educational, very interesting and teach you all about permaculture and lots of other aspects of eco-living. So check out our website and we'll see you soon. Bye.